What's up ladies and gentlemen, so this is going to be a different video than what my normal content is about. So this is actually going to be me doing a actual practice in regards to the occult field, specifically black magic uh, connected to the tunnels of set. So basically what I'm going to be doing in this video today is literally creating a ritual that is going to be publicly released on my channel so that anyone who views it is going to be partaking within this ritual simply by observation. Now I'm going to strategically set this up in a way so that if you want, you can participate as well and get energetic benefits from this ritual. The main idea of me releasing this is to increase my own power, okay, using the tunnels of set. So I'm literally going to go through every single tunnel this is going to be a short series on my channel, but I'm going to be doing a ritual for every one of these tunnels. Okay, so that's exactly what this video is going to be about. If you want to partake in this ritual, then definitely make sure you watch this video. I'm going to literally set it up in a very ritualistic, symbolic, uh, intentional way. And once again, if you want to partake in this, you can definitely do that as well. Um, I'm going to be demonstrating right off the bat exactly what I'm going to be using. This is going to be the only video where I'm going to be demonstrating how you can partake in this ritual because this is going to be a common theme going throughout all the other tunnels of set. So as long as you know what I'm doing in this video, then you're going to have a common understanding of what to do for the other tunnels. So basically what you're going to need is you're going to need some flashcards. Okay, so I have three flashcards in total. So I'm going to start here. So the first flashcard I have is going to be this sigil. Okay, what I'm going to do so that you can really see this sigil, because I know it's kind of small and it's hard to see, is I'm going to actually post a picture of it so that you can see it up close, so that you can copy this exact sigil. Once again, I created this sigil to specifically empower myself, but once again, this ritual is also designed to give you value if you're partaking, it, uh, partaking in it as well, and you're going to understand that once I read off uh, the chants that I have and the intention behind the ritual. Okay, so this is my specific sigil. It's already opened. It's already active, so you can copy this sigil and then write this number directly below it on a flashcard, which is the number 401, which is the number associated with Amproteus, which is the first tunnel uh, within the tunnels of Set, okay? So on the back side of this sigil, then what you're gonna do is you are going to draw this sigil, which is the sigil of Amproteus, and you're going to write 11 underneath because 11 is associated with the first tunnel of Set because we're including the 10 uh, spheres, the 10 Sephirothic spheres before the first tunnel, which equals 11. So write 11 underneath. Um, and where I got this sigil information is coming from the book, The Night Side of Eden by Kenneth Grant. So if you want to understand what the tunnels of set are and where I'm getting this information and where I'm finding all this symbolism, you can read the tunnels of set. Uh, you can read, excuse me, The Night Side of Eden by Kenneth Grant and understand more about the tunnels of set, which will give you more clarity on this entire series that I'm going to be doing. Once again, the intention behind the series is to increase my own power, okay? It's going to just open up the tunnels of set and constantly be a permanent generator on my own YouTube channel to give me power. And once again, if you're partaking in this, uh, partaking in this as well, you're going to get power from it as well, okay? As long as you're in alignment with the things that I speak about on my channel and you are focused on your own evolution, okay? So yeah, so make sure you have a flashcard, you copy the sigil, copy the number, then on the back side, you're gonna write the sigil of Amproteus just like this. Once again, I will post a picture so that you can see it up close, and then write the number 11 below it. And also, make sure you're using these same colors. Try your best to use these colors because these colors are associated with Amproteus and this tunnel, okay? Now, the next thing, once you have that flashcard, I have two other flashcards, 
okay? I'm gonna read off each one and I'm gonna break it down what they mean. And once again, this concept that I'm using is gonna be the same concept that I'm gonna use for all of the other tunnels. So once you understand what I'm breaking down right now for this first tunnel and Proteus, then you're gonna have an idea of how to move forward for the rest of the tunnels if you're gonna be actively performing some of these rituals, which are gonna be very powerful, okay? Um, so let me start with the, um, the first one that we're gonna be doing. So the first card is gonna be in regards to destroying my enemies. So in regards to enemies, this is gonna be an archetypal energy. So if you pull up the archetype of my enemies, this is gonna be an energy that's specifically representing people that are coming against my kingdom and my own evolution. So obviously when you're using the same archetype, that archetype is going to be attuned to what you view your enemies as, okay? Now obviously if your enemies um, are not uh, necessarily my enemies, so like if you're just, if your enemies are just like, you know, happen to be people that are actually like evolving and working on their, you know, their evolutionary journey, then it's not going to work for you. But if your enemies are similar to my enemies, where it's people that are, you know, highly possessed by parasitic energies and chaotic forces that are trying to come against your evolution, then this is going to be very uh, effective for you. Okay. So the first card is going to be in regards to, uh, I have written on one side, and Proteus destroy my enemies right now. Okay, so this is what you're going to do. You're going to get a flashcard, and this flashcard is going to be completely dedicated to your enemies. So you can go ahead and copy what I've wrote. So on one side, you're going to write, and Proteus destroy my enemies right now. This is giving uh, a signification or an intention to this entire flashcard and what we're going to be using this flashcard for. Okay, now on the other side, this is going to be all the chance that I'm going to state as I invoke and call up this uh, demonic force, Amproteus. And this is what I'm go going to be telling Amproteus what I need done and what I want to happen, okay, to my enemies specifically. So I'm going to read off what this says and you can literally copy it, okay? So the first statement is going to be an invocation. So I did this invocation in Latin and it says, Mia mi adit Amproteus venir. So M, and you know what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to post a picture of this entire sheet as well so that you can look over it and you can copy it and then we're going to go into the performing the ritual, okay? So make sure you copy this, okay? Once again, I'm going to post a picture so that you can see everything on here, but let me just go through it and state exactly what's going on. So once again, the first statement is going to be an invocation that I specifically created uh, that goes like this, Mia mi adit and prodius venir. Okay, which basically means in English, uh, Amproteus, come here and listen to my command. Okay, now the next statement is going to be Amproteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. Okay, that's the first statement. The next one is going to be Amproteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. Okay, that's going to be the second statement. The third is going to be Amproteus, strike and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. Okay, that's the third statement. Fourth is going to be, my enemies are those who come against my evolution and kingdom. Okay, that's the uh, fourth statement. The final statement is going to be, find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Do this right now, and Proteus is the end statement. Once again, I'm going to write it all out, and then I'm going to be going through the uh, the actual ritual. So I'm going to be reading off the statements, you know, on camera so that you can listen along, and you're also going to be seeing visuals that are on the camera that I'm going to have ritualistically programmed, which is going to be very interesting, and it is going to be very powerful using the same technology that all of the music industries, all of the movie industries and music video industries are all using the same technology, okay, just in a more potent way. <laughs> okay, um, so yes, this is gonna be this card, destroy the enemies. The next card is going to be in regards to good things brought back to you performing the ritual, specifically in this case, bringing good things to me, okay, me. So on the back side of the card, right here, I have written and Proteus, give me all of your knowledge, wisdom, and understanding as well as all of your sublime good right now. 
Okay, so I'll say that one more time. And Proteus, give me all of your knowledge, wisdom, and understanding as well as all of your sublime good right now. Okay, so that's what this card is designated to. Now on the other side with the chants, this is what it's going to state. The first uh, chant is once again going to be that same invocation. Mia, mi, adit, and Proteus, vanir. Okay, then the first chant is going to be, and Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. Okay, the next statement is going to be, and Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. Okay, I'll say that again. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. Okay, the third one is going to be, and Proteus, give me full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. Okay, uh, the next one is going to be, and Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. Okay, and these are all specifically programmed in regards to Amproteus and what Amproteus represents. Uh, once again, if you read the Night Side of Eden, you're going to see that all of the things that I'm saying in here are directly connected to this tunnel, okay? And I have personally initiated through this tunnel myself. So here we go for the last statement. Amproteus, give me all of your sublime good from your lightning strike, okay? And then the last thing says, Amproteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now, okay? And that's how we're going to end that. Once again, I am going to post a picture so that you can have all this information and literally copy it onto your own flashcards. Or you could use a piece of paper, but it would, would be easier on a flashcard. Um, and you're also going to see next to these statements, I have, for example, times 12. I have times 7. So I'm right next to the chance I have times a number. There's, you know, for this example, 12 and 7 signifying that I'm going to be saying that statement or that chant uh, that many times. So make sure you're also copying that to your flashcard. And once you watch the entire video and you do the ritual simply through observation and then you go to perform it yourself, make sure that you're saying the statements uh, that many times, okay, next to the, the chant. Okay, so once again, to wrap it up in a nutshell, we have two main, main uh, flashcards which are representing what we're intending and Proteus to do. One is to destroy the enemy. One is to give us all good things from the tunnel. And then we have this uh, middle flashcard, the main flashcard, which has this sigil, which is to bring good things. Okay, using the power of Amproteus. This is a sigil I created. This is the number of Amproteus in the tunnel. 401 and the colors that I drew it in are directly connected to Amproteus and then on the back we have the sigil of Amproteus um, herself and with the number okay so what we do when we finish is we are going to burn these flashcards so specifically we're going to burn the first flashcard which is going to be the Amproteus destroy my enemies right now we are going to burn this flashcard at the end of the ritual we're gonna burn it in the direction of east, okay? Because east is the direction of fire, which is the direction of hell, and is the direction of psychic warfare and deletion. So we're gonna make sure that our enemies get burnt in that direction, okay? Then, once we finish that, and, if, and for those of you that are Patreon members and understand how to use your crystals, make sure that you burn this inside of your triangle of arts with your three smoky quartz crystals, and you can have your triangle of art pointed towards the east. This is what I'm gonna be doing personally, okay? Now, when we finish burning that, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take this beginning sigil with the one on, of Amproteus and the one that I created, signifying taking the power from this tunnel, and we are going to take the flash card that has all the good things associated with Amproteus and the tunnel, and we're gonna take this flash card and put it directly behind our sigil, and then we're going to face the west, signifying all of the good things, the realm of air, which is also associated with Amproteus. And we are going to burn both of these flashcards together, just like this. Remember, the one with the chance is behind the one with the sigil. And we're going to burn it just like that, signifying that we're bringing all the good things uh, from this tunnel, from Amproteus, into our life burning it in the realm of the West, the realm of air and associated with the Tarot of Swords, okay? So that's exactly how we're going to finish this ritual. And once again, I'm gonna be doing this for all of the tunnels of set, so this will be a permanent um, 
ritual that is always going to be on my channel and it will be constantly generating energy once again using the same technology as all of these a-list celebrities you know so if it's good enough for them it's good enough for me so that's exactly what i'm going to do um so yeah so let's get right into it okay so without further ado we're going to go right into performing this ritual so simply sit back enjoy the ritual once again simply by observing this is also partaking in it okay so here we go so Mie mi adit emprodias venir. 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 Mi mi adit emprodias venir. Mie mi adit emprodias venir. Mie me adit emprodias vanir. Me, 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 me adit emprodias vanir. Mie mi adit emprodias vanir. Mie mi adit emprodias vanir. Mie mi adit emprodias vanir. Emprodius, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. Emprodius, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, destroy my enemies and trap them in your void. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, lock my enemies in the gate of nothingness with no key to get out. And Proteus, strike down and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. And Proteus, strike down and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. And Proteus, strike down and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. And Proteus, strike and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. And Proteus, strike and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. And Proteus, strike and destroy my enemies with the lightning bolt of hidden light. My enemies are those who come against my evolution and my kingdom.
My enemies are those who come against my evolution and kingdom. My enemies are those who come against my evolution and kingdom. My enemies are those who come against my evolution and kingdom. My enemies are those who come against my evolution and kingdom. Find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Find them, stop them, confuse them, and destroy them. Do this right now, and Proteus. Do this right now, and Proteus. Do this right now. And Proteus. Do this right now, 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 and Proteus. And Proteus, destroy my enemies right now. And that is done for the dark side of this ritual. Now we are going to move on to the other aspect of this ritual, gaining the power from the tunnel and the Kala of Amproteus. So what you're going to do now is you are going to face the direction of the west and then we are going to start this ritual. Mie, mi, adit, emprodias, venir. 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 Mia, me, adit, and prodias, vanir. 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 Mie mi adit and prodias 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 vanir. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your collar. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, Give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala.
And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the power from your tunnel and of your kala. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the awareness of all as one. And Proteus, give me the full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me the full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me the full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me the full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me full control of your gate and power over the hidden light. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me the power of divination to see the unseen. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good 
from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, give me all of the sublime good from your lightning strike. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, serve me and give me full control of your tunnel right now. And Proteus, give me all of your knowledge, wisdom, and understanding as well as all of your sublime good right now. And that's it. So now what we're going to do is we are going to take both of these flashcards once again, just to recap. And you are going to take the one that is in regards to destruction of your enemies. And you are now going to burn this flashcard in the direction of the east, symbolizing fire, deleting your enemies. Okay? So you are going to burn this flashcard, the one with your enemies, you are going to burn this in the east. Then we are going to burn this one that we just read in regards to the sublime good and all the good things from this tunnel. We are going to burn this in the direction of the west and we are going to specifically burn it with this other sigil that we have. And once again, this sigil is going to go in front of our chants and of our mantras on top, I should say. And then we are going to burn this in the direction of the West. Okay? So other than that, that is going to wrap it up, ladies and gentlemen. Um, <laughs> once again, I'm going to be making um, videos for every single tunnel of set. And they are all going to have very specific visualization. So you are going to be able to expect more of these videos on my channel. What I'm not going to do is I'm not going to be breaking down all the videos in this much depth because they are all going to be based on this same concept using these flashcards and using these directions. So once again, this is the video where it really gives you some understanding of how this works and you can use this same understanding, the same technique for all the other videos that I will be uploading for the other tunnels of set. Um, 
Once again, in this video, you know, as you saw towards the end of the video when I was reading over the mantra, I that was a, a form of possession. Um, that was basically my own daemon possessing me, commanding the spirit of um, and Proteus and you know that's why my voice ended up changing like that and this is what can happen when you do invocation okay but you know as someone who's done this many times I'm able to switch right back to my normal voice right afterwards and like to be honest I do not how I do not know how to do that with my voice this only happens through possession this only happens when you know, I'm usually commanding spirits. You know, whenever I command dark energies, um, my daemon will completely speak through me. And that is the voice of my daemon. It's the dark matter energy side of my um, astral body that is communicating with this other dark matter energy entity, in this case, Amproteus. So whenever, you know, you're communicating from that space uh, and it's coming out in that way, that is direct communication to the entity that once again, in this case, was Amproteus that will give it, um, you could say, a more potent and a quicker manifestation because of the tone that was coming out of my voice. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's going to wrap it up, ladies and gentlemen. Go ahead and burn your flashcards right now. I'm about to go do it, and that is going to wrap this video up. So other than that, I'm going to leave it here. Um, once again, this is not a normal video on my channel, but I am going to be doing this for every single tunnel I've set. Um, so yeah, we're going to leave it here. Ladies and gentlemen, have a wonderful rest of the day or night wherever you are. Peace.